Welcome back. We are just days away from the August 2nd primary, and there are several heated races, including the 11th congressional seat in Oakland County, where Congresswoman Haley Stevens is taking on Congressman Andy Levin. Now, because of redistricting, two Democratic members of Congress are up against each other. Grant Herms gives us a closer look at what's been happening in that race. The new 11th district is more diverse after redistricting by almost any breakdown, although it's still supposed to be favored Democrat come this fall. But this primary fight is pitting two Democrats against each other, turning into a bitter fight. It's a bitter fight in the new 11th. Two sitting Democrats in the race, Haley Stevens and Andy Levin. With all due respect to my colleague here. Stevens running on her age, the first millennial Michigan has sent to Congress, but also running on her involvement in the auto bailout in the Obama administration more than 10 years ago. Stevens styling herself as a voice for the auto industry and the auto worker who can work across the aisle. Levin is running as the progressive fighter in the race, showing off his liberal credentials after getting arrested twice in just the last week. Once during a protest against the overturning of Roe v. Wade and another during a sit in for unionizing cafeteria workers in the Senate. This race has also become one of the more expensive ones this year, flooded with out of state money. The conservative leaning pro Israel American Israel Public Affairs Committee has spent more than 2.4 million to back Stevens. On the other side, the liberal pro Israel group J Street has thrown its support behind Levin, attacking Stevens in new ads. The polling for this race has been sparse, but but the most recent poll showed Stevens up by 27 points, but that poll by the group Target Insight has a C to D rating by the website 538, so not the most reliable, something the Levin campaign has been quick to point out. They say their polls show that this race on Tuesday will be tight. In Hazel Park, Grant Herms, Local 4.